transmit. So since we don't view our left and right brain as separate consciousness, we just view it as one self. If two people with a chip can communicate faster than that, they might just be one consciousness. And the more people that plug in, the stronger that kind of hive might grow, just absorbing everyone along the way. So this person is making the argument that the Neuralink chips Elon Musk is creating can transmit information faster than our own neural pathways, and so if we're connected to it, we might be connected to a hive mind and never even know it. So I have some reservations with that whole string of thoughts, but what's more interesting to me, consciousness question number five, is how it might be like to be part of a hive mind. And let me tell you this, I think we have already experienced some forms of it. I have three examples. One, human civilization in its present form hinges upon the ability for random people to cooperate based on, much like in a hive, shared mental states, which for us come in the form of beliefs, values, identities, and ideas. Think of a good chunk of our understanding of who we are stems from our interactions with the society that we inhabit and contribute to. So to me, society is a prototype of a hive. It's not a literal hive mind, of course, because we have our own lives, goals, preferences, and perceptions of free will. Two, the symptoms of mob mentality, of which we have some pretty good recent examples, are eerily good at describing what it might be like to be part of a hive mind, like loss of self-awareness, anonymity, agreeableness, and heightened emotions. And three, I also find shades of the hive mind-like mentality in situations involving groupthink. This is when a highly cohesive group makes irrational decisions out of an urge to conform or out of fear of disharmony. Group polarization is a similar phenomenon where the beliefs, attitudes, decisions of a group tend to be more extreme than the individual group members. Think for yourself, are there any other present day hive mind-like scenarios that you can think of? And what do you think it will feel like to be in one?